Welcome back to Minecraft. Let's do this. All right. Last time we did a little bit of self-care. We did some gardening. We played around with the landscape down here. Uh, we're actually going to take our boat out this time. And we're going to see if we can really observe the changes we made to the Wolf Head Mountain. Let's gather up some of this from everything that dropped. All right. Hopefully it looks really cool. I don't think it could have made it worse, but, you know, you never know. I think we're going to need to wait till nighttime to be able to see any real difference. can see the ear a little bit better. Let's see, I think, yeah, I can get out over here. <laughs> There's the ocean monument just waiting, beckoning me to come take it on. Now, yeah, I think that makes it look a little bit better. We finished up that ear. I don't think it looks totally natural. Maybe we'll try to copy the other ear that did naturally spawn. And uh, we can't really see the light too well. Oh, the sun's going down. Oh, we need to get back now. Can't get it through there, but we need it over here. Actually, we want the sun to go down so we can look at the eyes. Chuck some torches in there. Come out here a little bit of distance. Yeah, look at that. Can almost see the glow. I think uh, next time I'll try to trim off that little bit there. And try to bring it in for the shape of the neck. But I think it's got the, the snout and the cheeks pretty good. The ears definitely look nice. Unfortunately, mobs have now spawned in, so this is going to be great. Starting off with creepers, apparently. I should avoid getting those pumpkins right now. Especially since I just heard a baby uh, zombie. Oh, you gotta be two creepers. Ow. Oh, of course you missed a creeper. Haha. There are monsters nearby. So what? There's a door between me and them. Now? No. Okay. Well, that's dumb. putting saplings in here sticks going here and everything's far enough away now yay there we go and now they can all start to burn Well, at least I got one of them away. Hm. 
Oh, that's right, that's right. I found some stuff and dug it up. Well, we made it to the pumpkins. I think there's supposed to be a stem. Hmm. I guess not a naturally forming pumpkins. Only a pumpkin. Only a pumpkin. Give me a seed. Only a pumpkin. Give me a seed. Only a pumpkin. Is there a certain way you need to break pumpkins? Axe seems like overkill. Of course, there's no melons just strewn about. Although, I think there are melons way back in the jungle area. It was naturally spawned there. That's uh, a lot of travel just to get to those, though. Did I not take all their wheat? I didn't take all their wheat. What was I thinking? Probably thinking nice, happy thoughts, but not anymore. <laughs> I want damn bread. And honestly, I could use a, a little bit of uh, leather. I want to turn you into a cheeseburger. Hold still. That's not what I wanted to use. Mm, look at all this wheat. I think the other ear definitely helps. So definitely, I certainly need to get up there and define it a bit more, but it definitely helps the wolf head. Keep holding shift to run, and I keep kicking myself for it. Okay, that's bizarrely sandy in the middle of nowhere. Why? No idea. Oh, wait, they got beets and potatoes and everything here. And carrots. Yeah. Beetroot seeds, beetroot potatoes. I think potatoes are their own seeds, even in this game. Carrot. And carrots are their own seeds. Uh, uh this dude's running around destroying our crops. Huh. Why do you guys have two iron golems? Seems a little bit overkill. Guess I shouldn't complain too much for keeping the villagers safe, and I may use the villagers eventually. No more cows, damn. Oh, I got a little bit of leather. I have, I think, two leather still stored. Better put these in the food and farming chest. As well as that, I'm gonna turn this into ooh, ooh, a lot. And I might as well take all of this and hold control and hold control and hold shift. Add some bread. Pumpkins in there. Cut that stack of bread down just a little bit. I'm gonna have. Oh, okay, that should be where all the stuff is. Um, books, paper should not be in here anymore. I think this is enough to make two books or one book. What is it? That. 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 Nope. 
Uh, I've never actually used this before. Book. Oh. So, give me more paper. You only need one leather per book, which is great. Very nice. Oh, nice. You just, you don't have to do anything. All right, I'll move that back because I hate the way that looks. Um, put our paper in there, books in there. Now we have 12 books. I think we need a lot for a bookshelf. So we're going to hold off on much of that for right now. I'll probably end up just trying to steal the bookshelf from the uh, guys over in the village. Recuperate from that beating I took. Uh, I think we're going to be expanding the farm now. Literally just a step down. That's where the dirt would go. That's where the water would go. See ya. I think we will set one of these up for carrots, one up for potatoes. We had iron right next to our bed this entire time. Oops. Pink. There we go. We'll take out this layer as well. Let's see. We'd get a little bit dangerous there sooner or later, but it should be fine for now. There, did, there we go. I'll just bring them all down here for now. Yeah, it should be fine. Okay. Now for this, because we don't need to be dying. I guess, yep, that's going to be too much. So this is exactly how much we need. Okay. I'll toss that up here for now. And we're going to need to make another chest. A couple more, actually. So let's get the crummy-looking wood. And we'll just make a stack of chests. Well, not a stack, but enough of them. And we're going to need to remove that. Hmm. Wink. Yoink. There we go. Make this one of those up there and one of those up there. Decently lit up now. Okay, place tech manager, iron ore can go in there for now, right? I think. Yeah. Um, what do we need? Now we need dirt. We need more dirt than that. I think we should be able to work with the coarse dirt. We're probably going to need to make another hoe. Uh, we don't care about the beet root. We do want potatoes. There's the potato. Uh, those are just normal wheat seeds. Don't want to do anything else? No, we should be good with that. Um, I guess those can go in there for now. Yeah, it should work. I don't know why the audio just cut out there, but that was weird. Okay, that's 
That's what I wanted to try to avoid. Hmm. There we go. Oh. So that's what course dirt's gonna do. It's gonna take two uses from a pig. Or not a pig, from a uh, hoe. Could make a diamond hoe. I think we're gonna stick with iron for right now. Uh sticks are down here. There we go. This one should last a minute. Yeah. Oh, wait, that's right. There we go. And as we grow those, we'll be able to get more and make more. Let's go ahead and sleep for now. Ooh, it's raining. It's unfortunate. That means it might not start killing mobs immediately. I know it's only raining over there. Or behind me. That uh, works out for the better. And by the better, I mean it works out for me. <laughs> Alright, so we can do this for coarse dirt. That is beautiful. Because we kind of need to. So we'll be knocking out all of these and then the layer below it. Oh. It's not going to finish because we still need to do the entire rope, uh, rope below me. Could start getting stairs for us of that now. Um, I've already got one of these. Might as well use it. That's gonna go a bit quicker now. Okay. I don't have enough coarse dirt for this, so. We need to go get more. No, you're not coming in. <laughs> there it is. Oh. Somehow I already have a stack of that. That's dumb. I'm gonna expand this out, give myself some headroom. There we go, sufficient lighting. Um, we already have a decent enough hoe, so what crop are we going to be planting in this one? Let's go for carrots. And we only need one bucket, which should stay with the farming stuff for now. Three, four, five, six, seven. All right. 
eight, nine, ten. There we go. Um, so yeah, now we get to start working on this. We'll make a staircase going along here. I think I still have blocks for that. I have one cobble deep slate stair. Let's get some more cobble deep slate. And let's put this cobble stone in here. There we go. Now we have 25 cobble deep slate stairs, which would be more than enough for this. That's not where I wanted that. I want that on the transition. That's dumb. There we go. Somehow that didn't destroy any crops, so hip hip hooray for me. <laughs> I think I will make this double at this point. There we go. I could make that a stair. Yeah, what does that do? Mm, doesn't hurt anything. Can't make this one anything, but that's a little bit less of a drop. Yeah, that's not bad at all. Cool. Oh, there is that. We will leave the hoe in here for now. Uh, put our bucket in here and grab our other one. Toss it up there too. Uh, sufficient lighting. Let's verify. Yes, we do. Cool. This is going quite well. Alright, let's start working around it here a little bit. Glad I can mine that. I don't have to build a new one every time. <laughs> oh, that is the outside world up there. Okay. That shouldn't be there. That's a good way to start spawning mobs in here. Um, let's take out this and we will move them down here now. We're going to turn this into a interior designer's nightmare. Not have the head of our head bed against anything. <laughs> Bounce, 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 bounce. Um, let's try to have this somewhat easy to access in the central-ish area of our base. We'll have that over there. It's a little bit less required. There's our furnace for now. Toss that stuff up in there. Wouldn't hurt us to get a lava block at the garbage disposal. Oh, but I don't need anything to mine that. Oh, thank God. Uh, we're just going to put that there. And now we should put a couple torches up here. Thoroughly lit. And again, the downside of the dog head is the fact that these guys can just stand out here and not burn. Oh, that worked out well. <laughs> uh, let's see. What else to do now? Decently organized. I don't know. Put this stuff down here. Got a decent amount of bone, which is going to be a ton of bone meal. I don't think there's anything else to do with bone. Okay, a ton of bone meal. <laughs> I didn't actually expect it to be that much. Um, what do we need to do with the pumpkin in order to, I mean, I guess eat it even, or do I need to do something with it up here? I can get pumpkin seeds out of pumpkin. Wow. Who, who would have guessed that one? 
Oh, that just yields a block. Uh, I have an axe in here. That yields a block extremely quick. Put our axe back for now. Um, What are you supposed to be able to do with pumpkin, then? I mean, pumpkin seeds are great, but the only thing that I know of I could do with a pumpkin is... I think you can carve it, and I don't even know how to do that. And then, uh... I think you probably need the right click with an axe. That makes sense. But you can carve it and then you can look at Enderman. Which doesn't get you anything unless you're in the end and you can barely see the end dragon. <clears throat> well, we've expanded our farm quite decently. I think some of these crops are almost ready to go. But I'm not sure about that. Can't even tell most of these by looking. I think that these are the potatoes and those are the carrots. Nope, that one was not ready. Good to know. Then have two full of wheat. Mm -mm. Another guy just wants to be axed. Ooh. Dude took some ball damage already. Guess I'll just start automatically converting that into bone mill. Um. Could start using some armor. I think the next thing we need right this second is the uh, leggings. Feet are about done for as well. There we go. I think if you have mending, you can put that in with that. And if it was slightly damaged, then it would combine and be less damaged as a whole. Where's uh, that? We'll put these up here. Um, those are some annoying sheep saplings that need to go in here. Just trying to keep somewhat organized. Mossy block doesn't need to go in here. Could go back and get some soul sand that I can make a soul sand farm. And then we'll hold off on that for right now. Doors don't really need to be in here. That can stay next to that because that's where I'm going to use it. Alright. Since this mirror is time, we're really starting to fly. That's not the right place to put that stuff. The point of things I didn't. Okay, yeah, this stuff goes in here. Going to sleep with my sword and shield on my arm. I think we will move to bed. That way it's uh, less likely to say, Oh no, there's monsters nearby. Yeah. Alrighty. Um, let's grab some of that cobbled stuff. Cobbled deep slate. I... That's basalt. I am actually out of cobbled deep slate. Hmm. Well, that's kind of what I want to use for my interior design, so let's go grab some more. Who knows, maybe we'll mine some stuff up as while we're on our way. Hmm. Running down the stairs is not as effective as running up them will be. <laughs> Let's get all the way down here. Careful we don't stumble across a ravine. Or cave system. We're either right above one or right under one. Hmm. 
Oh, we're right over one. Yeah, this is definitely cheesing these guys, but I kind of don't care. That is all ready to crumble down at a moment's notice. And that makes creepers a little bit more dangerous. So, this is moments, here's your notice. Oh, we need to actually update the block. There we go. Oh, there's nothing above it. That would have been cool. That's a little bit less cool. Anything good? No, they're not even spotted iron in this cave, if we can call it that. Okay, let's hop back up and out of here then. Let's go off in this way, that we don't stumble across that. Ah, oh, of course. Okay, how far can we get going this way? So far, not very. Now, this is going quite well. I mean, we found a cave system. It's not like the grandest cave system in the world, but it'll serve. There we go. Yeah, we could do some strip mining sometime eventually, and, uh, was that stuff? That was stuff. We could do some strip mining eventually, and we can see, uh, my brain will work. Um, yeah, we can see if we can get some more resources. Ah, yeah, this is going a lot better. Straight up. And look at that, still daylight out. Or stay light out again. One of the two. There we go with that. And we'll start with this one first. There we go. And we'll take care of this little strip right here. Yeah. Alright. Now uh, we got some of that. Uh, more of that. Don't care about that. Um, more bows. I wonder if I could just add those together now. Yeah, let's try it. Maybe we need to do this at an anvil. Nope, you can just add two bows together. Cool. So just by axing skeletons, I have almost got a full powered bow. Beautiful. Alrighty, where are we at? I think. Oh, let's get back in real quick. I think next time I want to get the melons. 
and I kind of hate that because that means I need to go back to a jungle. But I have a rough idea where the one is, and I can also you know, keep track of my coordinates this time. I'm just going to only take a boat to get out there as well. That way if I die, I'm only down a boat, which, oh no, a few sticks, whatever will I do. So, thanks guys for coming along for the ride. I will see you next time. Peace.